my channel, you guys. If you are new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. Don't forget to turn on the post notifications bell so you know when I post. I'm here every Thursday on YouTube, and if you like the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Shout out to our lucky charms of the day. Thank you guys for being so amazing. Make sure to go follow these lovely people on TikTok. Today, I am prank calling my friends. Which I am, I'm scared because, first of all, I have a phobia of talking on the phone. Since I was young, when I get on the phone, even to people I know, I start sweating, like my heart races really fast, I get like anxiety, like it's not good. Um, so <laughs> it's like a facing your fears exercise too today. But also the last time I prank called someone, I kind of got like the police call. Real quick short story, at my best friend's wedding, shout out to Catherine, um, we played truth or dare the night before and someone dared me to prank call the groom's room and say that his car was being towed and he got all worried and like, instead of like calling back the hotel and seeing or running down there, he called the police. So, anyway, I'm nervous. So we're not gonna do anything like that. But, um, yeah, we'll see how this goes. Uh, I'm scared. <laughs> Here we go, we're prank calling. We're doing this, you guys. Oh, I'm already nervous, I'm already nervous. Also, um, if, you, if you're like, where is Jackie sitting? I am in my brand new apartment! <laughs> Which I'm so excited about. I am now a mile away from the rest of Soup Group. Yee. It's, it's a very exciting thing. It's funny because I literally like set dress this one tiny corner of my couch. The rest of my apartment really looks like a tornado hit it. But you guys will see that in a vlog coming up, my moving vlog. So anyway, let's get this prank calling going. Oh my gosh, I'm freaking out. I just got a brand new phone number, which if you stick around till the end, I'm gonna be revealing to you guys. Cause I'm a crazy person, apparently. Just kidding. Stick around to the end where I tell you guys how you can text me. And call me, I guess. Just please don't prank call me. Goodness. So this is why I thought it was the perfect time to prank call all my friends before I give them my number. So, here we go. We are calling Nathan Pyland first. Yee! I'm so scared, you guys. Okay, whew. Composure, hands are sweating. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, calling you like that. Oh my God, I'm hitting the button. <laughs> Hello, this is Cynthia from the BBB, the best beard bureau. I don't know if you know, but someone named Nick entered you into the BBB contest and this year you are this year's best beard winner. Congratulations. Thank you. Upon your winning, you have received a lifetime supply beard grooming kit. All I need is a credit card number for us to charge your yearly membership fee of $10,000. What? I just need a credit card information for $10,000 to renew your yearly membership. What is it uh, calling? This is the Better Beard Bureau. It's for a YouTube video? We have a YouTube channel, you can subscribe to us. What, what is this? Who, who is this? <laughs> Hi, Nathan. <laughs> oh, wait, oh, he's Jack. <laughs> at, at first I thought it was like a Siri. I, like, but I, I, was like, I wasn't trying to be Siri, but that's how it came out. Congratulations on winning okay. the best beard uh, trophy. Yeah, I was like, wow. <laughs> okay, one done. That wasn't so bad, right? Oh my god. I don't like my voice. I don't like anything. I'm sweating. Okay. <laughs> oh. Let's call our fire. Our fire. Okay, I'm scared. Oi. Ah. Okay, we got to we got to call Chris because I accidentally already gave Sharla my new number. <laughs> So hopefully Chris didn't put it into his phone yet for us to be able to pull this prank off. 
and hopefully they don't recognize my voice. Okay, I got I got a plan for this, but I just gotta figure out a voice, you guys. We're calling. Hi, this is a Samantha. Um, I'm calling. I'm I'm here at your apartment complex, and I'm calling to politely request that you guys keep a uh, kind of a smaller profile here at the complex. Am I speaking to Chris? Oh, no. Um, this is actually Pizza Hut. I'm very sorry. Like, our order for you is not ready yet. Um, I just wanted to let you know that we have Pizza Hut and Pizza Hut Pizza Hut. Um, no, this is not, uh, this is not a joke, Mr. Kerr. Um, this is Samantha from up at the front desk. We Sorry. spotted we spotted two of your friends last night around 2 a.m. skipping through the reserved parking. And I think one has green hair and the other one's a blonde, kind of weird looking fella. And we're asking you, they're not really allowed on the property anymore. They were kind of causing a racket. Oh, okay. So, um, what's their name? Mike from Austin, and, uh, Buddy, I Sir, this is not, I, I will have security come to your door if you do not. Wait, this is Reddit. This is totally Reddit. This sounds exactly like Reddit. Oh my god, you have Reddit. Oh my god. Hi, Brenda. Hi. How'd you get her number? What? <laughs> you guys suck. What? Well, I just prank called Nathan and he had no idea it was me. I sounded like Siri. <laughs> Wait, is this for a YouTube? Yes, it's for a YouTube. That's why guys that's why I didn't tell you guys what my YouTube video was this week. Well YouTube make sure you don't trust Jackie. <laughs> Up next, Billy Man. Oh so a little background on this. We got to go to Korea, South Korea, and Billy was there. It was me, TJ, Billy, Kaylee, Drew. And so I'm gonna play a prank that, uh, about, about Korea. We'll just, just wait and see for the story. So, <laughs> I hate this. Every time I call, I'm like freaking out. <clears throat> okay, let's see if I can disguise my voice better this time. We're gonna do the British. Hello, uh, is, am I speaking to Billy Mann? Yes. Um, yes, this is uh, Cynthia uh, Caruso. I am the US ambassador for uh, relations with Korea. And uh, we're calling because we believe, uh, did you take a trip to South Korea back in November? Yep. Um, well, you see, we have reason to believe that um, because we do have surveillance of you at a certain palace in the in the South Korean capital, that you stole an ancient artifact from one of those palaces, and um, we 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 would appreciate it if you returned it immediately, um, or or further investigation will be had. Look, I don't think you know who you're talking. To. You're never gonna find me again. Um. Well, I'm just saying you may not be found, but if you don't return it immediately. And uh, an evil curse will unleash on you and everyone you love. I don't want that part. <laughs> well, um, I believe you had accomplices. Oh no! How do I live this curse? Um, I do believe you had accomplices. Uh, a blonde man, a girl with weirdly green hair, and um, some guy in a green jumpsuit. If you were to sacrifice one of those members of your party, um, I do believe the curse would be lifted. I think the accent changed me. <laughs> it did, it did, it was so bad. <laughs> you went from, and if you return the object. It was so bad. is if you take the object, I'm glad I made 
made you nervous for a half second. Next up, Annalise Jr. I'm gonna do it ASMR style because she does ASMR. So you're gonna be like, hi, yes. I hate this. Hi, this is Brittany Austin from the ASMR Society. And we were wanting to congratulate you on your award as the ASMR Queen of ASMR on YouTube this year. Am I speaking to Annalise? Yes, you are. Well, hi, Annalise. Congratulations on your ASMR award. Would you be able to attend our award ceremony in Los Angeles, California in two weeks? Uh, <laughs> this is a joke or not? This is, this is not a joke. This is Annalise Jr., correct? This is. Well, we want to congratulate you on your hard work in the ASMR community and would like to award you for your efforts. You're very welcome. What's the name of this award show? The National ASMR Society Awards. It will be broadcast on C-SPAN. You wouldn't. C-SPAN? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I watched that before. You were nominated by someone named Joe. I have here on my records. Yes, that is him. Yeah, he's my partner in the video. Yes. He can be your yeah. plus one to the event. Oh, perfect. Um, the event will be held at the Fonda Theater on April 12th. All we need is your social security number and credit card number to put a down payment of $10,000 on your seats. Take your time. All right. Yeah. All right, I got it. Okay, perfect. It's two five seven. <laughs> Hi, Annalise. Hello. <laughs> it's Jackie. <laughs> Hello. Hi. <laughs> Thanks for playing two along five, so seven. long. <laughs> trying to be quiet and do ASMR, but I'm so bad at it that it like turned into a robot voice. Yeah, it was like a robot. I was like... Yeah, I was like, I'm trying to whisper, but it's not working. <laughs> like, it has to be someone I know. Like, I'm so <laughs> well, anyways, yeah, it's for a YouTube video. You guys go follow Annalise Jr. on YouTube. Subscribe. <laughs> and Wednesday what again? <laughs> April 12th, April 12th. Tony, guess what? What, Billy? We're getting pizza! Pizza? Yeah! 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 This is the one that I'm worried about. Because out of all the people, they're gonna know my voice better than anyone, so I'm trying to figure out what I can do to really disguise it. So far, you guys have seen that my accent work is not the best. <laughs> As you can tell, every person that I've called has made a comment about how bad my accent was. Apparently, TJ in his apartment complex. There's been these people that have been playing music uh, all the time and like yelling and stuff like that. And he's like, obviously we're musicians, we don't care, but it's been excessive. And so I'm gonna pretend that I'm them and I got his number and I'm gonna chew him out for it. Hey, Dad! Okay, change of plans, you guys. 
I'm afraid it's not gonna be believable enough, so we're gonna bring in my dad and he's gonna call TJ. <laughs> as long as TJ doesn't get actually mad because it's gonna be too it's gonna be so believable. Hey, are you cool to be in the YouTube video real quick? You. Yeah. You sit here with me? Do I have to actually be in it? Yeah, you have to be in it. Is that okay? <clears> okay <throat> hey guys, this is my dad. <laughs> Say hi dad. Hi dad. Okay, guys, I'm having to do this because I know he's gonna call my bluff. <laughs> So, we're calling TJ. Dad knows TJ. TJ knows my dad, he's met him. But I don't think he'll recognize your voice, obviously, as much as he'll recognize mine. So he's had this neighbor that keeps like making a lot of noise and everything below him. And so what we're gonna do is you're gonna call, do you have a made up name that you go by? <laughs> no, no. Really. <laughs> we can think of something. This is Tom Ferguson, that sounds, like a nice name, right? So you're gonna be like, hi, this is Tom Ferguson, an apartment <laughs> below you. Do I need to write this down? We gotta do this perfect. Okay. So you're Tom Ferguson, an apartment <laughs> You're asking for TJ Black, an apartment. We've heard you've been complaining about us and we wanna clear the air. Just because we play our music at three in the morning doesn't give you a right to keep complaining and calling on us. Do you got it? You got your character? So do I, can I do, speak this in a different accent? Or just... Yeah, as long as it's not like <coughs> bad, because that's the whole point, my accent's bad. Just do it in your normal voice. Just don't have as much of a Texas accent. Take a strip away the Texas. Okay, I'll <laughs> see what I can do. Are you ready? And, and yelling, you can elaborate just, you know. And, and... I'm supposed to be angry at him because of Yeah, just kind of, like at first they'll be angry, but they kind of get there, you know? Okay, here we go. Are you ready? <coughs> <laughs> I'm so ready for this. I'm excited. <laughs> okay, here we go. So how far do we take this? I'll, t I'll, I'll jump it. So yeah, is this TJ Black? Who's this? This is Tom Ferguson. I'm in apartment I'm just below you. Aren't you, is this TJ Black in Um, yeah. Okay, so uh, I understand you're the guy that's been complaining about me playing my music too loud. And you know, is that right? Um, I don't think I was the only, I don't know, I was, I was complaining about whatever I heard, whether it was below or to the side of me or whatever. Yeah, what's well, my understanding, you're the guy that was complaining about it all. You know, that's not cool, dude. So, you know, I, uh, do you like music? Yeah. So, why are you complaining about my music? Well, I'm kind of a, I'm a late kind of guy, you know, and, and it's, you know, it, that's my prerogative if I want to stay up late and watch my movies with that on. But I also like my music, too, you know. Hey, hey, Tommy, are you talking to that guy in 621? Yeah. What, what is wrong with him? Hey, hey, is this, is this TJ Black? Oh crap, what if he actually thought it was real and he's running downstairs? <laughs> We're just gonna call him, cause I'm concerned now. Alright, I'm gonna tell you about it. Hey. 
I just said I can't talk right now. I'll call you back. Wait, no, 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 TJ, no, 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 TJ, TJ, are you, TJ, are you worried about the people below you? Yes. <laughs> that was us. <laughs> hey, TJ. <laughs> this is Tom Jefferson. <laughs> Ferguson. Ferguson, excuse me. Dude, <laughs> that was who? Was that you who did that voice of it sounding like some? Tra like trailer trash Tammy. The girl? Yeah, that was me. <laughs> it was Jackie and her dad. <laughs> it's for a YouTube video. I'm prank calling everyone, and that's why I didn't tell you guys what the YouTube video was. But um, but I knew that you would recognize my voice, so I was like, I gotta get TJ good because he's the one that's gonna criticize my accent. So I brought my dad in, so you wouldn't suspect it. <laughs> Here's the thing. <laughs> Like, yo, I was not, I was literally just sitting explaining. Like, <laughs> no. Like, yo, I'm about to have to, like, I'm about to have to go talk to the office. No, well, office I was literally myself. hoping that you were going to cuss my dad out. I was really hoping for that, and you didn't. You handled it so well, and I was mad. I know you are, but I just wanted to make you mad. That was great. So my my camera died during that, so I, I know, put up my phone. Nice That's why I put up my phone. Um, thanks, Dad, for helping me out with that. Thanks. That was very convincing. I'm very happy. You're very welcome. Thank you. My pleasure. What do you work at Chick Fil A? Anytime. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 That went worse and better than I planned. <laughs> Today's the day. I know I can do this. Three hours without coffee. I don't quite feel right. Five hours without coffee. Is my head supposed to be pounding? Give me coffee. Maybe I'll try another day. I've got stuff to do. Okay, up next, CJ, aka Opera Americano. It's not getting easier to do this. Okay, <clears throat> here we go. Her voice sounds really cute though. <laughs> Obviously, I'm not able to get to the phone right now. <laughs> Dang it. Wait, I'm, I'm getting an incoming call. Hello. Hi, is this CJ? Can I ask you Excuse me? Uh, yes, my name's Sarah. Um, I'm the owner of a um, Tesla, and I got this note on my car at the Soul Cycle in Beverly Hills, and it had this number on it because my door was all scratched up. And it said that it was you, um, and for you to call, you like left a note um, so that I could like get your insurance and all. Is this a prank call? No. No, this is Sarah, and you scratched up my Tesla. Yeah, this is Sarah. Sarah Paris? Who? <laughs> Hi, CJ, it's Jackie. stressful talking on the phone period is like the scariest thing for me but here's the moment that I've been talking about um, I am giving out my phone number this number you guys will be able to text me on um, you can send a text I'll be sending you guys updates like when I upload a new YouTube video if I put out new music when I'm going live so that there's a better way for me to communicate with all of you lucky charms so drum roll please <laughs> My number is 310-340-7740. Again, it's 310-340-7740. You can text me and you can stay up to date on all things 
me even though I'm boring. No, I'm just kidding. So go ahead and text me. I'll send you a message so that I have your contact information in my phone. Love you guys so much. Thank you for watching this video. Comment down below who you think I got the best out of all the prank calls. And shout out to everyone I prank called as well. All of their channels, TikToks, and Instagrams are linked below in my description. Go give them a follow for being such good sports. So make sure to subscribe to Soup Group. Bye. I'll text you later. <laughs> that, was, that was bad. Color me red, color me blue.